is going on guys great here today i'd like to talk about crown store gifting and how this has been an issue in eso for several months now and unfortunately the crown store gifting has been paused or pretty much done away with for a while now they're going to stop doing crown store gifting for the foreseeable future before i get into all the details be sure to check out everything down in the description the community discord my twitter and of course if you enjoy the video hit the like button and if you have not subscribed to the channel yet i hope you consider subscribing uh, the community manager did post on the forums yesterday starting today we're pausing in-game gifting via the crown store for the foreseeable future due to the ongoing fraudulent behavior we understand that the ability to gift to friends and guildmates is desired and a value for many of you we will continue to explore options that will allow us to re-enable the in-game gifting in the future it says thank you for your understanding and continued support now a few months back we did know that uh, they were having a lot of issues on console with gifting which kind of bled over into the game from the pc side the pc side has been having problems for several months now but it eventually kind of worked its way into the console side as well and at the time there was going to be some fixes within update 39 some new things they were going to do for the gifting try to do it through you know having to go through actually filing a, a ticket within the game to be able to gift items that was not working they're going to come up with a new idea of how to gift in general that apparently has not worked either and it seems like gifting in general is kind of getting put on the back burner for the foreseeable future which sounds like it's probably going to be a long time before we see gifting in game again that's just my personal opinion and a lot of people are thinking we may never see it in game ever uh, they may be something that is take out completely and I know that it's frustrating for some, especially for people that actually gift to friends, gift to guildmates, or either have people they know that actually gift them, you know, items for, you know, gold. And it is nice if you're a newer player uh, and you want to, you know, purchase DLC, maybe you don't want to buy, you know, DLC just straight up with, you know, real money. Or if you don't have ESL Plus at the time and you'd like to play DLC, you can always go find someone that you know that can sell those crowns to you and you can purchase those DLCs from them with in-game gold. If they would like or you can buy other items like crates whatever the case may be and i know this is going to be disappointing for a lot of fans out there some people may not care some people may not use this system some people may have gotten burned too much with the system over the years but at the same time it's something that's been in the game and something zoss is allowed to go on for a really long time and it's kind of a, a disappointing thing to see it shut down for the foreseeable future Anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.